tonight. And along with Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski, ready to call all the action. Ray Ferraro's down between the benches. Razor, what are you hearing down there? Well, two different things, really. The home team's talking about maintaining a forecheck, controlling the puck down low, get some zone time. The visitors are talking about pucks to the net, traffic in front of the goaltender, try to make it difficult for him. Enough talk, enough hype. Let's do this. Your first period is set to go. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. This has been one we've been waiting for for a while, and it's time to finally see what the payoff is all about. Gaudet's been nabbed for tripping. His stick gets in between his feet, and when the player goes down, the penalty's going to be called. Nice pass. Tremendous read as he pokes it away with a paddle. Russia's got the puck along the wall. Big stop by the goaltender right in front. Yeah, I hated when I missed chances like this, James. You don't get many that are this quality. You want to put them away because you don't know when the next one's going to come. On the redirect. Scores! Couple of things to look at here on the replay. Watch the positioning to deflect the puck. And then look how hard it is to track. The goalie's got all kinds of people all over the place trying to find the puck. Can't do it this time. Russia's got the game's first goal just past the midway mark of the first. What's the mindset now here? They were just talking on the bench. Let's go get another. I like it. You're up one. Be aggressive. Go push the other team against the wall. Hartman's got it on the offensive end. Sends a pass over. Well, that'll do it for an entertaining opening 20 minutes of hockey as the horn sounds. Russia's got a 1-0 lead and well-deserved based on how they played at both ends of the ice. As both teams get a breather here in this first intermission, we'll do the same and get ready for period number two. Join our Insiders Club today. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Hartman. Team USA's got the puck against the half wall. Barlamov's going to cover it up for a faceoff. While his team's ahead, he wants to make sure the pace of the game stays at the level they like. When they look at this on the video, James, the shooter's going to see that shot's not in a good enough position against a goalie this good. It's got to be better than that. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. Rushes a hit. Scores! And we are tied! They've been scratching around the edges of this game, and now they get it back to level. Let's look at this face-off play here on the replay, James. They're set, hoping they can win the draw, and when they do, the wheels are in motion that leads to this goal. USA's counterpunch pays off. They've evened things up here in the second. They've had really good legs since the start of this period, and it seemed like a matter of time before they punched through. Musa quickly over to Blackwell. Takes the feed, gets in front of it. The Russians move it in. Puts it towards Whoa. the net. He scores! Breaks the deadlock! Really good play at the net. And now somebody's got a lead, and we'll see if they can increase it. Goalie's trying to read here. He gets out at the top of his crease, makes the move to the butterfly, still gets beat up over the blocker. The Russians' hard work finally pays off with a one-goal lead in the second. That was a lot of effort just to get to the lead. Now you want to stay aggressive so you don't give it back. Quick feed to Jones. 
Officials getting ready to drop the puck to get play back underway. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside. Scores! Kaboom! What a shot! Nobody was stopping that one-timer. Wow, did he snap that back clean. It's right on the tape of the shooter, and he hammers it home. The Russians now have extended their lead to two in the second. They've been looking good here so far tonight. I've liked the way they've played, and while the game's a one-goal game, you still have to be pretty careful. Now they've got two. You can open it up a little bit, try and get a third one. Face-off looming as both centers get into position. USA's won the draw and they'll go to work. Makes a save! Gets a piece of it with the glove! For Lomas, goaltending at one end and the offensive output at the other has made for a good night. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Sends the pass over. Oh! Gets a little piece of it and keeps it out of the net. Barlamov's able to make the save look really easy. Now he doesn't have to deal with the rebound either. Both teams have gotten on the board, and this one has been pretty much a dogfight through the first 40 minutes as the period comes to an end. Hey, kids, don't forget if you're a member of our rookie team, you'll have the opportunity to have a couple of our players sign autographs after the game. What's in store for the third period? Let's tune in to find out just moments away. Time for the opening face-off here in period number three. James Sabalski and Ray Ferraro set to call the action for you. Team USA's won it. Receives the pass. Here's an opportunity. That's blocked. Slides that one right across the blue line. Made that stop. Quick shot. And there's another stop. Smothered that in close camp. Right side set up ahead into the middle of the ice. Rushes on the attack. Misses a golden opportunity there. Oh, man, he's frustrated with himself. He's got to get that on the net. Austin's got it along the wing. And he regains control of the puck. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Yeah, he got out tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. Varlamos now turned into the closer in baseball. Try and run this thing right to the end. Here in the later... Puck grab by Hayden. There's a shot. Oh, what a great stop as he got a piece of it with the glove. USA's goalie is on the bench. The extra attacker has jumped into the play. Icing's the call. You know the coaching staff's not going to love that one. Well, I can think of about three plays he could have made other than that one, but hey, that's the way it goes. Now you need your centerman to win a draw. James, I'm telling you, when you're the shooter and the goalie does this, the flashy glove save with a little spice on it, this rubs you the wrong way, but it is a great save. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. That win will help them get organized defensively. Scores into the empty net, and that should pretty much ice this one. Yeah, it always seems to be a foregone conclusion when the net is empty that if you can just get one chance, it's going to be put away for you. Oh, man, you just love playing with a guy like this. The passes are hard and flat. They're right on your tape. I played with a couple of them. John Anderson back when I was with Hartford, and then Alexi Kovalev with the Rangers. They could drop it on your tape from anywhere. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. The Russians win possession here in the open ice. And that play's broken up. Moves the puck. Hartman's got it in the defensive end. Moves it to Galchenyuk. Here he is, wrists it on net. Makes the 
Glove stop. And that will close the book on this one here tonight. Russia's coaching staff kind of like what they saw tonight here, Ray. I don't think they're going to find anything to complain about. The goalie was good. They moved the puck out of their zone and won going away. And that'll do it from ringside, everyone. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Get home safely. Thanks so much for joining us.